Hello, I'm Lado Ochotnikov. In this video I would like to put up an end to comparisons with Forsage. Now that we have already preparing various products and programs in parallel, I am not at all interested in arguing about which of us is the so-called original and who is copying something. Of course, earlier, at the beginning of the year, I myself said that Metaforce is a true Forsage, but this is only because then we did not have such clearly defined guidelines, it was far from releases and Metaforce was really conceived as a continuation of what I implemented in the last project, which was just the initial step for next development. It was a springboard from which we were able to accelerate in order to proceed further. Now the usurpers of Forsage are bragging about what an unstoppable business is and in the original matrices. They would like everyone to forget about the stopped smart game and return focus on the first matrices that I created. However, Forsage, like other matrix projects, has one problem. This business does not scale. It is not designed for some fundamental new development. This is a simple program with one level of function. Money is simply transferred from one participant to another. Well, there are also reinvestments, which are also have one level of function with the simplest rule, without the option to cancel, without the choice of options. So, in Forsage, smart contracts are so simple that there is nothing to compare. The transition from level to level are the same, everything is the same there. There is no product binding, no funds, no expansion of fun uh, functionality. Everything is simple there. Therefore, it is clear that it is much easier to correct there when errors were found in the contract. And there were errors at launch, and even several times had to restart smart contract again. Therefore, all these comparisons, it was like this in Forsage and it wasn't like that in Forsage, are not relevant. Understand, in scale, Metaforce is like 300 Forsages. Even in terms of the complexity of the code of one of the element, the classic program, this is incomparable. Yes, the ideas of decentralization and freedom, unlimited opportunities for any person, these ideas are at the heart of Forsage, they are also at the heart of Metaforce. I even wanted to develop all this within one system with Forsage, although I immediately saw the problem that all these interactions were not included in the code and in the strategy. The only possible thing within Forsage was the same uh, programs on different blockchains. Something fundamentally new could be combined only under the name of the brand. Unfortunately, they combined under the name of Forsage a financial pyramid. They associated scam game with the Forsage name and they continued in that direction. They have there, as you know, there was an additional program to take money from the participants and they want to continue such methods. Because of this, we now have to distance ourselves from the name of Forsage. Because now since the appearance of scam game, Forsage is associated with it. As honest as Forsage's original business was, its name is now tarnished. Smart game is against the law. Keep that in mind when promoting Forsage. What if you have to take legal liability for it? These are your risks. Think for yourself. But I don't like comparisons not only because there is a tarnished reputation, but also because we now have a completely different level. In the former project no additional functions were included. And there are a lot of them in metaphors. The classic program alone which is the simplest, is an order of magnitude more complex than any Forsage program. It must immediately take into account all interactions with other programs and as aspects 
of the system. And most importantly, with 100% payout of the network, you get a sought-after valuable product, which is an additional opportunity to earn. In addition, you have a passive income component, which I will describe you in next video. All types of income are economically justified, no pyramid schemes. Classic is only a particle, only one of the planets of a huge galaxy, the whole Metaphors universe. We are developing many things at the same time now. Let me remind you the context of the current situation. Due to the fact that many then stopped, the participants of the former project were left without work. And they were in a hurry because they needed to, uh, the opportunity to start acting sooner. I accordingly asked the IT team to find a way to get things done as soon as possible. And there was an erroneous assessment that the Classic and Boost programs are much simpler than Uniteverse, on which we will have the idea of our crypto. And it seemed that they are easy to quickly do while everyone is waiting for the main program Uniteverse, although the main one began to be done earlier. But as more and more details were revealed in the process, it became increasingly clear that the complexity of these programs had been grossly underestimated. And if I had in advance the picture that I see in front of me now, then I would first launch Uniteverse and only then would start creating Classic and Boost. We had got a race against time. Due to the haste, important details were missed, due to which several times we had to start all over again. So, as a result, the rush did not speed up the process, but led to startup errors. So, I learned a number of lessons that I will take into account in the future and will not repeat the mistakes. However, you could see it in our open tests that we were able to release everything successfully. On mass tests, all transactions were error-free. And after the tests, just before the launch, we were necessary to make some changes that were not fully covered by the tests. But there was already too much anticipation. Everyone was shooting, please, this time, in no case, do not transfer from June uh, 29 to some other day. Under this pressure, we decided to take change and release a product that has not been fully tested since the last change. It turned out that in vain we did it. First needs to cover 100% tests. Although, on the other hand, the presence of a working referral connection now make it possible to relieve uh, another tension that has been in the community all this time. Because while waiting, many active participants were afraid of losing teams. Uh, well, we were in a hurry with the first launch. We will not repeat this with the next ones. What should we do now? Among the problems that have appeared, there is nothing incorrigible. And it is already clear how to prevent this from happening in the future. That is, the fact that in the future metaphors will work stably for a long time. We can be sure. Everyone could make sure in the test that our program is able to work correctly. Accordingly, now we are fixing everything. After that, we open the work of the back office on the site and the releases of all further launches will be only after fully covered tests. Of course, you haven't had enough facts yet to see how much Metaphors is an incomparably different level. So far, you see only classic. But the next releases will be much more impressive, after which all talk of comparisons will stop. Soon everyone will be convinced of how great the force is in us. We are with you. Force.